Sydney Grace, and Mel Say No More. Okay, it's a winning combo. Hi guys, it's Mary. Welcome back. Today we're going to do something I'm so excited for, mostly because I don't have to keep this secret anymore. <laughs> Of course, I'm talking about my friend Mel's palette. Two of my favorite things in the whole world have come together in one place. It's Mel and Sydney Grace in the Tiny Marvels. Look at that. Tell me when this makes sense and then I'll pull away. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, isn't it cute? And then on the back, you can uh, pause this if you want to read it. These are all the ingredients that are in this fabulous palette. I'm not going to read this to you because I want you to be able to pause it and experience what Mel had to say for yourself. It's personal. See, there you go. Wait, Mel's video, I'm gonna link it below because it's her story to tell. So you guys should go let her tell it. I'm just gonna tell you how enthused I am and show you some looks. And I just couldn't be more happy, more thrilled for Mel. She worked on this a really long time with them guys. You know how much I love Red Chameleon. This is Scarab in this palette, which is also Red Chameleon in their line, but it's the only one that isn't new. What I typically like to do with that shade is a one and done. If you want something real quick, just take this, put it on your lid, and then take a blending brush and all the way up. And what you will get is this intense, shade that's so beautiful that blends out to a red brown. It's gorgeous. So now for the most important information that you probably want to know is when is it launching? How much is it? It's launching today, August the 7th, 9 a.m. PST, or that's noon Eastern Standard I'm going to do some looks for you and link Mel below so that you can go listen to her fabulous story. Before we get started, there you go. That's her, and now we're gonna look at some swatches. It's durable. You know, your klutzy friend here has dropped it a few times. It goes all the way back so that you can hold it in your hands if you want, or you can hold it like this and use the fabulous mirror that is on the inside. It's not too thick. I think it would travel nicely. I know Mel personally, and this is Mel. Her heart and soul is in this. And just like Mel herself, it's a tiny marvel. It really is. This is the essence of Mel, this palette, these colors, the, the packs of punch, the and what would you expect? Who wouldn't expect for Sydney Grace to choose Mel and for Mel to work with Sydney Grace? This just makes sense, doesn't it? The palette's total weight is 30 grams. It has 15 shades, nine of which are mattes. And look at this beautifulness. Let's do the looks. One of the reasons that I was thinking about this look that I'm gonna do is because I wanted to show, this is the E25 coming into Mantis. If you guessed that Mantis is my favorite shade, you would be right. I wanna show you that you do not have to use a brown in your crease. You can use a color <laughs> in your crease. I know that we don't do that a lot, but you can. And I'm gonna take Mantis right here in the crease. I'm just patting it in. I really don't need to blend these that much. I'm gonna take my E35 and blend out the top. E55 shader into BB, and I'm going to bring BB all over the lid. Oh, 
dip into Bugaboo and I'm going to just kind of work right here. Not really right here on the bottom of my eye, but just at the bottom of this crease. And this is the E36, just lightly bringing that in. I don't want to lose my green. Yeah, I just want a tiny bit of Bugaboo. Because this is my bad side, let's just come up a little bit higher so you can see it's there because it's kind of lost in that little hood. <laughs> I want to take Maybelline's Jade Olive Liner and bring it down here a little. This is one of those colors that you kind of really have to be right up close to to even know that it's not, say, brown. <laughs> bring it right here too. Maybe you'll be able to see it is a green in my waterline. I really kind of wanted to lay that down because I'm also going to take Mantis on the E46 and right over the top of this Jade Olive, I'm going to put a little bit of Mantis. That way you know for sure that's green. I don't want to come too far in because now I want to get web on here and you know what I'm going to do with it. I'm gonna bring it right here on the inner corner. That's why we didn't come all the way in. I love that shade, it's so bright. I'm gonna tap into Spider, and just right here on the edge, I wanna drag up a little tiny wing right there. Okay, so this is a look in itself, right? But I can't stay out of fire butts. So the intent here is to get fire butts and come over the top of BB with it and that's going to give you a totally different color. I'm going to start right there where our web starts and bring it in a little bit on top of BB. <sighs> I want a little BB to stay behind but I definitely have to have fire butts because I love it so much. All right let's get some mascara and I'm going to go for the Charlotte Tilbury Fat Lashes. I think that's what this is called. What do you think?
I already bought two of these and I did it so I could do a giveaway to you guys. Actually, I'm going to say this is from me and Sydney Grace because I tried to buy two, but Laura wouldn't let me pay for the second one. So this is from me and Sydney Grace. That's right. This video here is going to be a giveaway of this tiny marvel. What I'd like you to do is tell me below, put in the comments if you want to be entered to win this palette, what Mel's channel used to be called. And if you know the answer to that, then I feel like you're a big enough fan of Mel Thompson that you really want to win this palette. So you do that, put that below. And yes, do I need to tell you who's the best part? of the Fritzy family. You know it's you. If you're not having a blessed day, then kindly go out and be a blessing to somebody else. And until next time, love you, see ya. Bye. <laughs> and I'm out. Alright guys, I lost my magnifying glass and I feel really lost without it. Okay, I'm still looking for the magnifying glass. Where is it? I'm not going to be able to film without the magnifying glass. I need the magnifying glass. Where are you, magnifying glass? You make me want to... You make me want to throw my pager out the window Tell MCI to cut the phone poles Break my lease so I can move Cause you're a bugaboo, a bugaboo You make me want to <laughs> I bet of people who might watch this of a certain age Don't even know who MCI is Do you know what pagers are? Have you ever heard of dial-up? <laughs> so that you can get the skinny I bet I could play a song if I tried really hard <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not gonna break anything The palette's not really in there <laughs> But you know I'm just gonna sit here and go blah, 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 blah until you wanna smack me and say, shut up, Mary, and get on with it. That was so rude of you. No. <laughs> All right, so the palette is 15 shades, 30 grams. Does it work better if you keep doing that? The palette right here, this one. I think I will just go ahead and dick right into, you dick. Oh, no. Ooh, baby. Baby, baby. Baby, baby. Ooh, baby, baby. Baby, baby. Ooh, baby, baby. Baby, baby. Ooh, my bra is showing. Let's make it part of my look. Yeah. There. Okay, this just kind of looks like it's part of the shirt, right? No? Too bad. No. That was like a throat fart. Right? Is that what you would call that? I call that a throat fart. I call that a throat fart. When your throat goes... I don't know what it is, really.